Hello everyone. Happy Monday, March 14th. So today we are going to be talking about some wonderful oils uh, to move us through this moment in time. So today is the 14th of March and then uh, the full moon is this Friday, the 18th, and then spring equinox is on Sunday the 20th. So lots of great uh, energetic moments, heightened energetic moments coming up. Um, also a feeling of balance uh, at the equinox. Um, and of course, the feeling of excitement that things will warm up, um, especially for all of you in the Northeast. I've it's been warm here and and then the last day or so has been a little cold so i've had to dust off my some of my winter clothes anyway it's all good so uh the first oil is um copaiba for today and copaiba is the oil of unveiling um i like to put it at my spine the back of my neck and um it helps us to understand are the deeper meanings and messages that are coming through that are showing up in your life. Also, the third eye is great, right, for helping with clarity. Um, this is the oil that so effectively supports our um, endocannabinoid system and really makes um, our nervous system feel soothed and nurtured um, and helps it to uh, relax. So um, it helps us also to forgive ourselves after we have been kind of out of integrity or um, not at our best. And it brings us back to our truth and our uh, heart center and integrity in ourselves, as well as like our connection with source and um, it helps to bring reassurance to body and mind. Um, it also helps to heal bones. So I've been using a lot of Copaiba. Um, it also helps reduce pain. Um, so it's a wonderful one to use um, on muscle aches and pains. Okay. Uh, Console is our next um, blend. Uh, up and console uh, I'm gonna put right over my heart it is very very soothing and comforting it has um, frankincense patchouli ylang ylang labdanum amorous <clears throat> sandalwood rose and osmanthus so it is um, filled with grounding um, loving, nurturing kinds of oils. It soothes emotional pain after times of stress or trauma or loss. It helps us to release these stuck, heavy feelings and um, brings in rest, a sense of serenity, a sense of healing. So just smelling uh, that oil, smelling these together is really going to be helpful diffusing them together, putting them on topically together, layered like we just did right now, is um, gonna be really helpful for, uh, for feelings of um, overwhelm in terms of grief and feelings of being out of control, feelings of um, overwhelm with, with uh, things that are happening outside of yourself, current events. So I highly recommend layering these two on you for today. Okay, and our card of the day is trust in your higher self, eagle. <clears throat> and this comes from our Power Animal Oracle deck by Stephen Farmer. It's an oldie but a goodie. I haven't used these in a while. And um, this you know, trust in your higher self. I mean, how awesome is that? Allow your intuition, your deep body knowing um, to guide you. You know, breathe into yourself. Sit and allow yourself to reconnect 
back with yourself. Again, using these oils is a great way. And then have faith in the straightforward, um, clear, encouraging messages that you get from, um, from the divine or from source connection or from your higher self, however you want to think of it. Um, but have faith in those um, in those deep feelings that are propelling you in a certain direction because it's right that direction is correct so um there you have it happy monday um and i hope everyone has a beautiful couple of weeks tonight i am again doing my daily practice uh, at 8.15, you can go on my website at drmara.net, D-R-M-A-R-A.net, and sign up there. Um, I also do individual sessions and really channel in the messages of these oils and all kinds of other things um, during our sessions. So if you're interested in that, there's more information as well on my website. And yeah, sending all the love all the light and um, looking forward to seeing you in a couple of weeks at the beginning of spring. Bye everybody, all the love.